We're going to blow up a tube and I'll show you how fast it does that. Today we're going to be taking a look at DeWalt's inflator. I think this is something you should have. Number one, if you've got kids, you're blowing up all kinds of pool toys, rafts, bike tires, all that type of stuff. This is something a garage should definitely have. So the battery slides in the bottom just like this. We've got our inflator hose, which just clips in really nicely. And then you can hook it up right here and that's how you blow up your toys, your rafts, whatever you need to do. Great for filling up your inflatable paddle boards. We also have mounts on the side for a Presta valve, for filling up fancy bike tires and two other mounts. This is for like basketballs and then a larger nozzle here for filling up other items like blow up toys. And they all clip right in on the side here. The cool thing about this, this is the inflator side at the bottom. If you wanna deflate something really fast, instead of laying on top of your air mattress, all you have to do, stick this up top and this will suck the air out and blow it out the bottom. This is a selling point that I just had to have when I bought this. Really will speed up deflating those massive rafts. Now we'll just clip all this back in. This hose right here will fill up your beach balls, your bike tires, anything like that. It'll use these small attachments on the side. In this compartment, we have the option of charging with 12 volt. So you can plug this right into a cigarette lighter or a power port in your car. And then this just plugs in the bottom, just like so. Really long cord, nice storage area. But I typically use this with a battery. Now let's look at the controls. To turn this on, just press the on button. It's got a light on it. So if you press the light, it turns on right here. So if you are filling up, let's say a car tire, you can actually see what you're doing and it's pointed in the direction of this cable. Now there's two options. One is for the hose and one is for this hose and that's the selector switches right here. So when you're looking at that side, that's for this side here. When we're over on this side, it's for this unit over here. Now we can adjust the PSI just by turning this dial. Now I'll turn it on so you can hear what it sounds like. So we'll just set it to 8.5 PSI. There we go. I'll let you hear what it sounds like on the inflator. So let's pump up a bike tire. Got one right here, just a bike tube. So you just screw it on. Just like so. Go to our selector switch, turn up our PSI, 27. Let's give that a go, press on, and watch it fill out. You can see how fast that is. Now you can't deflate with this nozzle, only with the nozzle on the side here, the larger one. The ability to fill up a tire that fast, it also has an auto shut off on it, so you can't over inflate. Once you reach that exact PSI, it stops. All right guys, hope you liked the video. Keep on crushing it. We'll catch you later.